It's the middle of summer and you're dying to get out on the water. So come with me for a quick walk around tour of this 270 Sea Ray Sundancer. She's got lots of features. She's got shoreside air conditioning, comes with a trailer and a camper back enclosure. Well powered with a Merc Cruiser 454 engine in very good condition. So she's ready to rock and roll for the rest of the summer. Come join me as we preview this vessel. Here we are starting off port forward bow. We see we've got a windlass right there. Easy to anchor, easy up, easy down with the foot pedals. Coming down along the side, we've got this oversized foredeck. That's what I'm gonna call it LLI, ladies like it feature. Have a sun pad made and lay out there. Sea Ray does an excellent job in this vintage. We have stainless steel port lights and we have the Taylor curved windshield. We've got part of the canvas up right there. We do have the forward facing windows. We see the Isinglass is in very nice condition. And here we are at the swim step. We've got a couple rod holders where the ski toe eye is, an extended swim platform. Once aboard the vessel, we see we have our trunk storage right here. Great place for lines and our shore power plug-in. We also have a couple additional rod holders for the fishermen in the family. As we enter the vessel, we see right before us, we've got a nice entry. Here's another LLI, ladies like it. We have that port side chaise lounge. And then off to starboard, we have this configuration, now that transom seat folds up fishermen you could use it as a combing pad there's also a cocktail table that can be lowered and there's a filler cushion here for yet another sun pad engine access is relatively easy we've got a full hatch right here on gas assisted shocks you can even leave the seat down, and there we are. This is the table that you can use as a filler board back here. This gives us an overall view of the engine space, Merc Cruiser V8, 7.4 MPI. The risers and manifolds are fresh on this. Off to one corner, we see we have our hot water, heater, couple batteries, and a holding tank right there. The bilge is nice and dry, and we've got various through-haul pickups over here, one for the overboard discharge, looks like another for maybe a cooling system with an additional battery. Once we finish with our inspection, we just drop the hatch and there we are under this double wide helm seat right here we have storage gotta love this thigh rise bolster so it's nice and easy to drive standing up here at the helm we've got a classic wood tilt steering wheel We've got all of our rocker switches here. These are in very good condition. These have been redone, so they're nice and firm. We've got a standard VHF radio right there. All of our gauges up top, compass, and then our GPS 498 unit right there. Entry to the Ford deck is right up these steps that are built into the door. Sea Ray was known for that. We enter the cabin through the center line door, down a few steps, and this gives us a nice overview of the cabin. Immediately to port, we see we have our booth style dinette right there. Now this table 
has a lower leg, so you can use it also as a sleeping area. We've got gunnel storage up top. And then as we circle around, we see we have our shoreside air conditioning right there. Forward, we have a dinette. And again, this can be lowered and it creates another sleeping area with a privacy curtain right there. We've got upgraded ultra leather upholstery, the whole air conditioned interior is vinyl lined so she's easy to care for easy to clean as we circle around we've got our formed in fiberglass galley right here coriand style countertop formed in sink obviously a faucet this is interesting this is a great feature we have a butane gas stove just get that one pound can and put it in or use the microwave. Our power panels right here. And then we've got some lower storage right there. As we circle aft, we have our fully lined fiberglass head, vacuum flush toilet system, and we do have a Mass Raider overboard discharge. We've got the RV pull out shower right there and because the whole unit is all fiberglass and gel coat it's easy to wipe down when we're finished got a full length mirror there Sea Ray makes excellent use of space that's where our storage goes trash got a privacy curtain right here nice little changing area more storage and then we have a double wide berth here. We've got about three and a half feet of headroom on the entry. We've got window there. And then that, this is full beam and it's usually a spot to store, we'll call it stuff. This vessel is neat, clean, odor free, ready to go anywhere because as i said she's on a trailer so you can bring her anywhere 